Ours is a time of continual movement, which often leads to restlessness with the risk of doing for the sake of doing. We must resist this temptation. Now, temptation is not from God. It's from someone else. <laughs> so this is a temptation. We must try to be before trying to do. In this regard, we should recall how Jesus reproved Martha. Remember? Martha, 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 you, Martha. You're anxious about many things. One thing is needful. Mary has chosen the better part. What was Mary doing? Sitting at the feet of Jesus and looking at him and listening. That's what she was doing. She was being a listener. She has chosen the better part. It will not be taken from her. Why? Because what Mary was doing at that moment touches much more deeply the mystery of the Holy Trinity and our time in eternity than anything else. We don't need for faith. We'll, God will be there. We don't need to say, I think He's there. I think I believe. The full reality will be there. There will be no need for faith in heaven. There will be no faith. There will be no need for hope. Everything, every hope will have been fulfilled far beyond anything we could ever hope or ask or imagine. There will only be love.